All right, this is just a test. Cool, I think we're doing good. Sorry guys. I do not want to scratch my lens. Ah, it's much better. All right. Going for a little walk. I have autofocus set on, so I hope uh, hope it all works out. It's a good little test shot anyway. What brings us out here? Oh, what brings me out here? I just hope this microphone doesn't get hit by wind. If it does, I'm so sorry. Did a video the other day and I had to scrap it because I washed out the entire screen. I didn't have my white balance set for the right setting. And, uh, I was also in a pissy mood too, so I was kind of angry. So I had a little bit of time to think and reflect on what's been going on in the last little while. Here, how about I change that to this side since the sun's over there. All right, so where does this leave us? I was talking about money and seeing as I don't have any, it's probably good as time as any because I've had some time to think about that too. Um, I was saying in the last video that I scrapped that if we didn't worship it, it wouldn't be so important. Now, I understand what some of you might be thinking because it's like necessary, right? It's absolutely necessary for us to buy and sell products that the global markets provided for us. And, uh, kind of hard to you know work within the confines of a system a dogmatic prison if you would that barters our own lives and free will at their own discretion fooling our parents into registering us which is just like a way of saying uh, they bequeath their ownership or guardianship of us you register something, all you're doing is giving somebody else the power to take it away from you. Just like our rights. When they define your rights and then enter it in as law, laws can be removed by simple bureaucracy and so-called democratic motions. Um, Bringing this back to money though, I'm not going to go into full detail on fiat currencies because there's tons of information out there. The truth or community, most of you already know it. So it's not something that uh, I need to tell them because well, they're already in the know. So this is more or less for those who, who aren't in the know. Um, your money, well, what you think is money is actually currency and it's worthless. Give me a sec. All right, cool. Yeah, we're still recording. Yeah, what you what you call money is actually worthless. It's not really money. Money is something tangible, which has intrinsic value on its own. Money, as you know it, is just legal tender. Legal tender means that, well, it's all based on trust and, uh, and IOUs. And like I said, I'm not gonna get fully into detail, but basically, it's debt that's been traded off um, for more debt. In fact, they, you give up that currency and then that currency gets basically sold off for more currency and then they try and sell it back to you uh, through the use of uh, interest rates, um, loans, loans with interest rates. It's a pretty, pretty diabolical system really and you know the people in charge are laughing all the way to the bank so to speak 
Um, it wasn't meant to be funny, but it's true. What can we do? Well, we can wait for the debt ceiling to raise so high that the economic system itself collapses on its own because it will eventually balloon out of control and there'd be no way for it to actually uh, sustain itself. Just have to wait for the, you know, the day to come. And it probably won't be a good one. This is probably why they're planning a, a plan B or a plan C. I call it plan B, plan brick, but that's just me. That's my theory. Um, there's lots of theories out there what's going to happen. Um, what can we do? I mean, it's hard to ask of people because some of y'all have kids, you know, you have lives, you have things that you've already got in motion that you have to pay for or you believe. I say if you have any, any power at all within, just don't, don't, don't play ball. Go ahead, take out loans. Sure, just don't pay them back. <laughs> don't pay back your interest. You don't need to. They, took it, they take it from you and sell it back anyway. Um, there's more information on this, and I promise I'll, I'll supply that information to tell you how the mechanics work. But don't feel bad, don't feel guilty. Um, like none of these are lawful contracts. Even the, your, your birth registration, like that's not a lawful contract. Um, those debts that are being created are not your debts. That's a corporation of you created, not by you, but for you on your behalf by someone else as a result of the registration process. Um, we can fight the system um, or the system can collapse, like I said. I mean, this would be part one of a many parter as I travel across, well, back across to where I came from in BC and then, I don't know, I'm going to try and hit different uh, categories of thought as they kind of enter my brain. Um, this is like part one. Just when, uh, you know, just think about it, guys. I'll be back shortly.